What's up guys? This is Paul the SA Badger. Reason why I'm dressed up today, cause today was freaking Alamo City Comic Con. Freaking awesome con this year, guys. Um, I just wanted to share this quick video with you because I just want to show you what I picked up. Now, yeah, as you know, I'm a statue collector. They had a very small selection of statues, and of course they were very, very overpriced. So I need to say I pass a lot of that. But I went there mostly looking for artwork. Um, if you follow this channel, you know that seldomly I do also collect pops. I didn't even bother looking at them because if you follow me, you know that I'm not really a pop collector. My focus wasn't on that. My focus was just on original artwork. So that's what I wanted to share with you today. Let me show you what I got. First off, good classic right here, the Iron Giant. How can you go wrong with that? I'll show you right there. There it is. Kind of an original artwork. Um, you know, he has a dent. Pretty accurate. He has a dent in his head. There's Hogarth, background. Um, pretty nice little print. So, Iron Giant. Classic. Can't go wrong with that. Next one is actually one that I really like. It was um, one of a kind. I should say, the guy only made 10 of these. And I was actually fortunate enough to get the very first one. One of 10. Um, it's like a metallic print hologram kind of Lydia Dietz Day of the Dead version. Really love this Beetlejuice character, cartoon version. Just real cute. Like it too. One to ten. And we have some metallic prints too. Now with this one, guys, I was really debating should I get the regular print or should I get the metallic prints and unfortunately as you can see here the metallic print is smaller than for example like this one which will have been uh, the regular print but since metallic it just looks so much more badass in my opinion anyway this uh, the guy who made this had a whole bunch of them they're basically like playing cards um face playing cards you know jack king queen so there's a top and there's a bottom this one what i got maleficent with the maleficent dragon um check that out it upside down just like a playing card um metal print too so it's that metal print that metallic look real shiny real glossy love it from the same vendor he didn't have a metallic print of this but i mean this is perfect for the occasion so i'm gonna turn it around right now and i think you'll like it so it's a combination of um Tim Burton's work. So I can see it's The Nightmare Before Christmas combined with Batman and Batman Returns. Obviously you can see Jack is Batman. Um, the mayor down here is the penguin and the duck. Um, it's kind of funny because there's a duck there and in the in Nightmare Before Christmas there was actually a duck toy that Jack had made. You can see Sally here is Catwoman and in the back there's a Joker played by Oogie Boogie. Uh, some fault, more detail right here. The three playing cards are actually Lock, Shock, and Barrel. Um, wish they had they had this one in a metallic print. I would definitely got that one as well. But nonetheless, just love this print. Okay. And the rest of them are actually metallics. I got a pretty good deal on these. So the first one, guys, this was actually a rendition of a character that's in existence now. But I'm not sure if they've actually designed this. Okay. And I'll explain to you a little bit when I show it to you. So this one is actually Spider-Gwen, but there's concept art where she's being venomized into Gwenom. And I've seen that where she has like the black symbiote, but I don't think they've actually created the red carnage version of Spider-Gwen. And this is what this is. It's the red version. The guy actually had the exact same print, but it was, you know, Spider-Gwen's white outfit with the black symbiote coming on her. It was... Um, Gwenum, uh, but this one's a red version, you know, it's very reminiscent of Carnage. Um, don't know if that is an act of existence or if this is a concept work for something that's going to come up pretty soon. Okay. Same artist here, guys. This is um, very cute, uh, classic, can't go wrong. Um, it's actually um, Who Framed Roger Rabbit, but this art frame print I should say has like a Rolling Stone background in it and um, 
you know, it's like a magazine cover. And these are all metal prints as well. So, real cute one. Good friend Roger Rabbit. Of course, same thing, Rolling Stone with one of the DC Trinities. Wonder Woman right there. Again, the Rolling Stone. Very cool concept, right? Liked it. Uh, another one, uh, this one's actually the DC Sirens. Um, it's Harley Quinn, Catwoman, and Poison Ivy. Uh, same thing, metal art print. Uh, cool design, really enjoy it. And very last one, guys. Um, where I was talking to you earlier about the Gwenum. Well, here it is. You know, here's Gwen Stacy, Spider Gwen, with the symbiote. Um, taking over her. Actually has some things right here. It says Spider-Man dies, Gwenum hates Parker, and yeah, I make boys cry. <laughs> so anyway, um, there's Gwenum right there. Very cool content, very cool design. Um, I want to say though, what I did see at the con, or I should say what I didn't see at the con, is these two. Um, now, in videos that I've seen, yeah, I have seen some Gwenums, but I've never seen um, a Carnage um, Spider Gwen. So, if any of you guys are thinking about trying something new, definitely go with this, because I have not seen this. I did not see this at the con, nor have I seen any con videos. So, yeah, definitely something to consider, guys. Anyway, that's my haul for Comic Con 2008. Um, very fun. Uh, lots of people, good friendly people. Um, no problems, no issues. And as of tonight, I'm actually going to go to a club, Brass Monkey. Hopefully, I can win their Halloween contest. Top prize is $500. I'll let you know if I win it or not. Anyways, makeup here was fresh in the morning. It's kind of weathered, which is actually a good thing because I think it makes it look more authentic. Anyway, guys, that's all I have. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, uh, give me a like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.